Hope you enjoy this excerpt from this week's new episode of Crossing the Line with M. William Phelps. It's late evening, a gorgeous August night in 2018 in Southern California. Papa Tom Perez Sr. leashes his dog for a short walk out to the mailbox to fetch the day's mail. Such a routine, repetitive task many of us do without even thinking. Papa Tom is in his 70s. He speaks very little English. He and his son have been living together for quite some time and had an argument earlier that day. The following morning, Thomas gets up and begins looking around the house for Papa Tom. Papa Tom had never come home. Thomas feels it's time to call in the police. Papa Tom has never taken off like this. According to Officer Joanna Pena, when Fontana police received the call from Thomas, she says he comes across distracted and unconcerned with his father's sudden disappearance. Officers are thinking only one thing. Thomas Perez Jr. knows something. As Thomas heads off to the station, Fontana police search the Perez house. They also bring in a canine to sniff around. During this initial search, Fontana police believe there are blood stains on the carpet leading up the stairs. Then the dog hits on what it is trained to, human remains. With those two discoveries, Thomas Perez Jr. quickly goes from witness to suspect. Inside the Fontana PD, Thomas sits waiting for the police to ask him questions.